There's a potential hazard lurking in most of our kitchens. It's microwaves that can start all by themselves. Yeah, when it happened to an Orem woman, she decided it was time to call KSL consumer investigator Matt Gephardt. And Matt, you've been looking into this one for a while. Yes, indeed, Dini Mike. Good evening. Yeah, microwaves, of course, are a fast, easy way to cook food at the push of a button, but our investigation found dozens upon dozens of microwaves, starting without anybody pushing any buttons. And that is, of course, dangerous. Smells like burn. <laughs> it does. Yeah. It smells like it. It smells like it's been on fire. <laughs> Chris Hammond says that her relatively new microwave just fired up. Nobody was in the room. There was nothing inside. Built the house with smoke, started the smoke alarm. Somebody in the house reacted quickly, running the smoldering appliance out of the kitchen and into the backyard. I see this as a consumer risk to have a microwave to start on its own. That could have been a disaster. You know, burn down my home, cost thousands and thousands of damage, and someone could have been hurt. Chris says she contacted the maker of the microwave, Samsung, which came out and repaired the machine, but Chris wants her money back. Beyond smelling bad, she worries it could happen again. She says Samsung has refused. So I feel like they should stand behind their product. With that, Chris decided it was time to call me. You ask, KSL investigates. We reached out to Samsung to ask about all of this. They would not get into details except to say that they have been in contact with the Hammond family and are addressing their concerns to their satisfaction. Indeed, Chris confirmed that after our calls, Samsung reached out. Smoking while not used. But digging deeper, we found this is not a problem that is unique to Samsung, or really unique at all. Spontaneously caught fire while not in use. The KSL investigators combed through five years of complaints filed with the Consumer Product Safety Commission. There is example. Oh, yeah, you can see the char all up in here. Yeah. After example. The microwave suddenly started on fire. After example of microwaves spontaneously starting. $30,000 of damage. In fact, in the past five years, 89 U.S. consumers say their machine self-started. And of the 88 reports of microwave fires, 29 of those happened thanks to a self-start. And that's just the people who bothered to report their issue to the feds. The actual numbers are likely higher. Have you ever heard of a microwave starting by itself? Yes, I have. None of this comes as a surprise to Colleen German. It's fairly common. German is the operations manager here at the mending shed in Orem where they specialize in appliance repair. So the burning question, what is causing these microwaves to burn? My number one tip for microwaves, um, don't slam the door. German says there are switches in a microwave's door that can become damaged. It makes the machine stop working and it can make the machine start working when you don't want it to. So if one of the switches is bad in it and has essentially almost grounded itself so it's sending power constantly, it'll turn on the microwave all on its own. That's the kind of thing it, that can happen from slamming the door? Yeah, absolutely. How old was this microwave? Nine months. Should a microwave last longer than nine months? Yes, it should. As for Chris, she has bought a new microwave. She just does not trust this repaired one, and she hopes that her story serves as a warning to others. And there, besides handling your microwave with care and not slamming the door, German says there are other things you can do to try to protect yourself from something like this happening, but although they are cumbersome. One is, of course, you could unplug the thing between each use. The other is take a bowl, fill it with water, stick it in the microwave when it's not in use. That way, if it does turn on, or even if a kid comes through the room and hits a button and turns the thing on, there's something in there besides the microwave to cook.